my goodness, I have a pile of puppies here. It's the most precious thing ever. Um, these guys all came in together as strays, um, just together. All three of them are looking pretty much exactly like. We've got um, Char here. Oh my goodness! I'm, I'm, it's hard to even film this video because I'm saying, oh my goodness, so much. We have Char here with the waggly tail, just wagging and getting a belly scratches. Char's ID number is A four eight one two nine six two. And Char, as you can see, Char has the most. Uh, I think the most coloration of brindle here out of the three. I'm Amazing. She is a female puppy, about seven months old, um, and she weighs 35 pounds right now. And right next to Char, we have Cleo, ID number A4812960. Um, also, again, seven months old. Goodness gracious, Cleo weighs 31 pounds right now. <laughs> and Countess here, laid out in the lap of luxury, um, A4812961. Um, also, again, seven months old and 30 pounds right now, so they're all right in the 30s pound range. But of course they are seven months old and they're all going to get bigger. Um, how much do do we have a, a range of what we think they'll end up being? Maybe 50s. 50s, in 50, the 50s 55. maybe. Um, yeah. Uh, in the much bigger? Uh, you know, so they're, they're good medium-sized dogs. I mean, they're going to be medium-sized dogs. And uh, so, you know, if you're looking for a medium-sized dog, these guys are so precious, so loving. You know, they're kind of like, what the heck am I doing in a shelter? They have no idea how they ended up here. Um, but they're quickly warming up. As you can see, super friendly and affectionate. Um, they, You know, we expect them to fully come out of their shell. They're Australian Shepherd mixes of some sort. Just gorgeous, affectionate, amazing puppies. And as puppies, they're going to need all of their, you know, traditional training, their skills workshop, their leash training, you know, everything that gets them the good puppy start that they need to be amazing dogs and great family dogs. And I just want to add that this is a total transformation. They were very uh, shut down because they were overwhelmed in this shelter environment. So yes. When we first got them out, we were carrying these 30 plus pound dogs oh, because they didn't want to walk. But now that they've had a little bit of time out and been yes. sort of reunited, uh, they are, the tails are wagging, the belly rubs are being solicited, so yes. the dogs are just going to blossom when they get out of the shelter environment oh, and absolutely. into a, a loving home. Yeah, yeah, we expect them to be wonderful, medium-sized family dogs, good medium energy. Um, we'd love to see them go to active families, you know, as bigger dogs they are going to need um, some good exercise, good walks and hikes, um, but as you can see, they're also going to be super affectionate and loving, you know, if you're looking for one, two, or three um, <laughs> of, of these guys, we'd love to see them all go to good homes, either together or separately, and uh, just as a reminder, please stay new to your pets, because we don't want these beauties ending up in the shelter. We want them in good homes, right guys? Yes. So come on down to the Baldwin Park Shelter um, and take a look at Char. Again, she's a female. Take a look at Cleo, also a female. And take a look at Countess, also a female, at the Baldwin Park Shelter. Bye-bye. Sweet, sweet puppies. Puppy pile, puppy pile. Bye-bye.